We are following breaking news today from Holt County. The search for a missing Missouri State Highway Patrol officer is now a recovery effort. The trooper and his canine companion went missing about uh, three yesterday afternoon in Big Lake. Lindsay Shively is there live with more. Linz. And good morning, Curtis and Beth. We now know that they are searching for Fred Guthrie Jr., who had been with the Water Patrol for 17 years and is now considered a Missouri Highway uh, Patrol officer after the two departments merged earlier this year. The search is going to resume at daylight. They have stopped it right now. It happened just about a mile and a half down this road, uh, Road 118, just uh, outside of Mound City, Missouri. I have Sergeant Bill Lowe here with me this morning talking about, you know, flooding. You don't always expect that it's going to be so dangerous. You think the floodwaters are kind of stagnant. Not the case here, huh? Not the case at all. Uh, in the area where this took place, the water is rushing uh, extremely fast. Uh, and like you said, you, you would think it would be calm because it's a field. However, the, the water has to go somewhere, and it's, it's traveling at a high rate of speed. It's made it kind of dangerous for search crews too, right? Absolutely. Uh, the reason why we weren't searching tonight is due to the fact that it's low visibility, uh, the fact that the water is rushing so fast, and, and you want to make sure that uh, the rescuers are safe as they're, as they're searching the area. On top of these tough conditions, a lot of these searchers know who's missing too, right? Absolutely. Uh, you know, we're, we are looking for one of our own. Uh, you know, doing that makes it, makes it even more difficult. Uh, but knowing that uh, it makes our efforts even more uh, uh, steadfast that we're uh, going to continue this in, in the heat, uh, no matter what the, what the uh, time frame is, we're going to continue until, until we locate them. Yeah, let's talk about that for a second. This is supposed to be the hottest day of the year. I know everybody is at least getting some sleep now. Are you guys doing anything extra tomorrow to try to deal with that? Well, we'll have uh, plenty of personnel here uh, to continue the search. Uh, we'll have plenty of water and, and food to replenish uh, any kind of dehydration that, that has gone on. But uh, we'll have plenty of people here to help and, and get through this. Thank you very much. So again, the search continues at daylight. This was reported yesterday when somebody saw his car door standing open attached to his boat still. So somebody saw the car door open. Nobody saw this happen. They are assuming he was swept away by these intense floodwaters just a mile and a half down the road from where we're standing right now. Lindsay Shively, NBC Action News Today.